Good morning, y'all. It's Monday. It's officially the last week of real estate classes. It's currently 856. So I'm about to go in here and get myself situated and set up. And yeah, it's the last week. Final next to Monday. And then state exam. So yeah, we got a lockdown this week. So um, yeah, I'm about to go in class. And then I'll check in with y'all at lunchtime. All right, y'all, so it's lunchtime. Well, lunch is actually about to be over. It's 12.55. I already finished two chapters today, so he's zooming through everything. So we should be able to get through two more. Class done's at 4.30, so yeah, he's flying through, y'all. It's almost the end. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know, but I'm excited. I want to be a real estate agent, y'all. Because you got to speak it into existence. I will be a real... Well, I can't say it because I'm not one yet. That's <laughs> I can't say it because I'm not one yet. But I will be a licensed real estate agent. I can't say... I can't say realtor because I'm not one yet. But I will be. By the end of the month. Before this month is... Before this month is out, mark my words, today is March 6th. Before this month is out, before this month is out, I will be a licensed real estate agent. In Jesus' name. Amen. Good morning, y'all. Happy Tuesday. Um, if you can tell I'm in the office. Um, so yeah, today is an at-home study day. Um yeah, it's an at-home study day, um, making myself my own study guide, um, so, making my own study guide, I got some things that I need to take care of and do, um, besides business stuff, like, I gotta make a couple phone calls, got a business meeting later on, um, I have a business meeting later on, listen, you always gotta have your stuff in order, and together like 2023 is my rebrand year and i'm just making sure like everything is together i'm ocd anyway but like we like top notch getting like everything together together like if it wasn't together before it's about to be top notch together because um i don't know i just feel like once i finish real estate school and past my exam like everything is just going to take up and I just got to make sure things are in line and in order right now so um yeah so that's what we doing I'm composing my um my study guide together for myself so I can start studying for my state exam as well as my class exam too um which that will be next Monday is my class exam um, so yeah, I'm about to sit down. I'll honestly be down here all day. Um, until, well, I usually eat lunch around 12. So I'm going to eat lunch at 12. It's currently, what time is it? It's currently 1029. So, um, yeah, I'm about to sit down here till 12, go upstairs at 12, find me something to eat. I usually take like a little hour break and then I come back down. Um, I'm not going to stay down here too late, but at least probably until like 7 o'clock, 7.30 because, yeah, then I got to get my daughter ready for bed and everything like that and get her ready for tomorrow because I have class tomorrow. So, yeah, we're going to make this a very productive day, get some things done. I always write a list for things that I need to do on my day off. So, um, so I'm about to get into that. And, yeah, we're going to have a productive day. So, let's go. So, y'all know what mother's job is never done. Baby girl hurt her finger in recess and it's jammed, but the nurse said it's swollen. So now I have to go pick her up and get an x ray done just to make sure it's not broken or anything like that. So, yeah, now I'm about to go sit at my job on my day off to go make sure she's okay. 
okay let's get out the door good morning y'all happy wednesday um so after i picked my daughter up from school we went to the er emergency room and her finger is fractured so <laughs> i swear this week I mean, I ain't even gonna say this week, but it's never a dull moment with my daughter. So, her finger is fractured. Um, so, yeah. So, today, <laughs> it is currently 7.39. I don't usually leave for school this early, well, for class this early, but um, I need to stop and get gas. So, we're actually about to load up the car and head on out and yeah i'll check in with y'all when i get to school yeah good day it's going to be a great awesome day i'll receive good news you'll receive good news whatever the good news may be but it's going to be an awesome day so i'll see you later Alright y'all, so it's 8.47. I usually don't get here this early, but I'm here early today. So that feels pretty good getting here early. Um so I'll probably go in like 8.55. Um and yeah, and get myself situated for the day. Um, but yeah, right now, I'm just chilling, relaxing, actually getting my pocketbook situated because it's kind of junky, but yeah, so I'm about to go in class soon and I'll check in with y'all when I go to lunch. Good morning, y'all. Happy Monday. So today is, what's today? Today is February 3rd. 13 and um it's final testing day so um it's actually 8 34 i'm at the duncan across the street from my school um i figured i'd leave out early come to the duncan down here sit in the car for a little bit and read over my material at least one more time before we take our exam but he did say that he's going to review um he did say he was going to review before we actually take our exam. Um, so out of 110 questions, we could get 30 wrong, I believe, or 33 for 70%, something like that. What? Oh, excuse me, that's why I get my coffee. But <laughs> we in a Dunkin' line, and I'm gonna head over to school. Um, and then, yeah, so, but on the agenda for this week is to definitely um is to definitely be studying um for my state exam so how they do it is we take the test today they put it in their system the school sends it to the like the state exam people psi they send it to psi and then psi will send us an email when we can schedule so i'm going to try to schedule sooner rather than later so i don't forget anything so this whole entire week is still going to consist of studying um and i'm actually going to i feel like so my school is not with color williams but they're associated with the keller williams that's upstairs um and they did talk to us tell us about like their listing process what their office has to offer and honestly color williams office has a lot to offer but this is like 40 something minutes from my house but if you know new jersey um you know where i'm at is kind of like cape may so there's like a lot of like rental um like vacation homes and stuff like that for people so it's like i can hang my they call it hanging if you're new here um so first of all i didn't even do no intro like if you knew so this starting off a new weekly vlog if you're new here my name's christina um and I'm in real estate school. I do business and 
um, lifestyle on my channel. Um, so, yeah, I forgot to do a whole intro. But, anywho, um, so I can hang my license here, but I can also handle business down by me. Um, so, I'm thinking about doing that. Um, I'm actually, but it is a Keller Williams, like 10 or 15 minutes from my house. Um, is that my car making it on? I think it was. Um, but there is a Keller Williams like 10 or 15 minutes from my house. So, um, this week will be a week to like interview brokers and stuff. So, I do have my fingerprints appointment, but it's not until March 21st. Um, so, even if I take my state exam and I pass, I can't hang my license with a broker until I get my fingerprints done also. So, it's like I have time, but I don't want to wait too long for everything. So, um, I'm probably going to be interviewing brokerages. And um, just seeing who I want to hang my license with. But so far, the Keller Williams where I'm at, where I'm taking my classes at, is actually, they offer a lot. They gave us a paper, like the fees and stuff like that. And they have, what is it called? So they have Royal, I think, I forget what they call it. But they have like a time where like you can sign up on their list um, and they try to divvy it out fairly um amongst everybody in the office and everybody at this office and what you do is you come in for two hours a day and if any leads walk in or anything like that like they're yours because you signed them on the list that means you're dedicating your time to try to get listings and clients and things like that so um i like that but even though they're Keller Williams, all Keller Williams are their own brokerages, so everyone can be different. So I would like to interview with the one closer by my house just to see what they have to offer. But yo, I've been talking for almost five minutes, so yeah, I'm in the Dunkin' line. I'm about to order my Dunkin' and head across the street to school, and then I'll check in with y'all when I finish my test. Happy Monday. It's going to be a great week, y'all. We're going to have an awesome week, a week of great news. Anything, everything is going to be good. It's just going to be a great week. But I'll see y'all later. Time to order my drink. Good morning, Yo, guess who passed? So it's currently 11.33. Once we're finished, we were able to leave. So I'm actually about to be on my way home. But the studying doesn't stop because now it's time. Well, once he, you know, hopefully everybody finishes and passes today, we are able to take it, um, to take our class exam, um, pretty much as many times as we can or want to, should I say? Um, so yeah, thank God for that. So I'm actually about to be on my way home, um, and then I still got to study, so I'm, I think I might take the day off from studying since I just did a test and everything and pick back up tomorrow and hopefully they have our stuff in by tomorrow so I can go ahead and um schedule my exam so yay I'm done real estate classes so now the real work begins y'all I'm so excited <laughs> but on to the state exam is next and then when I do that y'all I might cry I might cry when I pass that exam, but we on our way home, and I'll check in with y'all later. Thank you, God. All right, y'all, so, hold on, let me mute my TV. So, it is, oh, so it is hours later. I don't know if the light ain't gonna be too good. Don't mind my girlfriends in the back. They my homies. <laughs> they my homies when all us fails. Listen, I'm in my room. But, um, so, yesterday was Tuesday. So, Tuesday, when I finished my class, I cheated myself to some Ulta. So, I'm going to just show y'all real quick what I had got from Ulta. I'm not a makeup girl, but I feel like, um, I just want to start like a little light makeup to no makeup. I feel like the glare is going to be like. I'm gonna have to stay right here because the light from the back is gonna give a glare. But I want to do like a make, uh, like a no look makeup look. 
is the look that I'm trying to go for. So I don't know. But anyway, I had got this MAC um, foundation. Um, listen, when she is the NC55 Studio Fix Fluid um, Makeup. It says 24-hour wear, buildable, full matte coverage, oil shine control. So I'm an oily but dry skin girl. Listen, when she put this on my face, baby. B, you couldn't even tell I had makeup on. Like, it was just perfect blend match. And she got this right in the first try. So, I was like, okay. Um, and she was a clinic worker. So, she gave me a... Uh, I told her I needed a better a better concealer. So, she gave me a Clinique um, concealer. And this is WN98. So, hopefully it can focus. Um, so, she got me that. And then I got a setting spray. This is the MAC Mini also. I don't know if it's really going to uh, focus good. But it's fixed and stay over. And it's alcohol free. But a little mini setting spray. So we could try it out. I got the mini. And then um, I had got some Fame Perfume. This smells so good. But when I was in there. It's this Versace new perfume. I believe it's called Dylan. It's a purple bottle. Listen. I'm going back for that. I'm treating myself to that. Once I pass my state exam, I'm treating myself to that. That's my treat for myself. So, y'all, listen. I don't know if y'all been seeing this camera, but this camera has been on TikTok. I had it before I bought my camera. I'm using the Sony ZVF1. Um, that's the camera that I vlog on. Um, it, came, it just came out. So, they had the Sony ZV1. And then they had the ZV1F. The only really difference with the Sony ZV1F is the lens is the lens doesn't go out. So it's more so for vlogging. So the lens is like smaller. So it doesn't like it zooms in and zooms out, but I don't have the lens that actually extends itself, if that makes sense. So I bought this camera. So when I had this camera, I had returned it because I was going to do a vlogging camera. I was trying, you know, find a cheaper way out. So I bought this one. Now the pictures were clear, so I went a camera where I could take pictures on here but I don't want it to mess up my storage so this was like $119 plus they had $20 off so it was like $99 so I bought this and the cameras was clear the cameras the pictures were clear when I was taking my pictures on here so um I have a lot of like little trips and weekends coming up so I want to be you know taking my pictures and not all on my phone because of course it takes up storage even though I have the 14 Pro Max and the 256 gig, but that's neither here or there. I just wanted a camera, so this is what I got. And yeah, so it is currently, I don't know, it's almost 9 30, so I'm actually about to take it down and be getting up early, having a productive day. I have two appointments tomorrow, not business related, but I get my nails done tomorrow and I have another appointment before that, so we're going to have a productive day tomorrow, and I'm waking up early to get some stuff done. I was studying tonight, and I bought CompuCram. Um, I had purchased it before when I had took my real estate exam class and everything, but um, I don't know. This time, <clears throat> excuse me, this time I'm doing so much better, so yeah, so I'm about to head to bed. My daughter's getting ready for bed herself, so I'm about to get ready for bed myself. And we won't have a good day tomorrow. And I got to run some errands. So, good night, y'all. See you tomorrow. Good morning, y'all. It's currently 9.02. So, I'm actually en route to run, um, to try to make this store first before I have my appointment at 10 o'clock. Which I should be able to when I wrote a list down of what I need. Um, I need to go to Family Dollar um, and grab a couple of things. And then head to my appointment. And then after that, I might just stay outside. Because I have another appointment at 1.30. So, there's no point in, like, going back in the house. I hate, like, going in the house and coming back out the house. Like, once I'm in the house, I try to be in the house for the day. So, I'm en route to run my errands for today. And then we're studying for today. And then I have to, um wash and blow dry my daughter's hair later on tonight because she has an appointment tomorrow have a girl they said right <laughs> um but yes yeah, so we're in route for that
and yeah so let's go so store number one is done um, it's currently 940 so perfect time and that's the time I wanted to be out of there um, I got all everything that I needed on my list um, listen, I'm one of the people that gotta have a list or like I forget. And I still forgot something because it wasn't on the list. <laughs> I'm just about to say I'm one of them people that need a list or I forget everything and I forgot I needed rubber bands. But that's okay because my daughter left her finger splint at home. So once I finish my appointment, I might have to go back home anyway to go get it to take it to her school so yeah it was never a dull day that's why i'd be like if i was working like a monday to friday nine to five like sometimes i feel like i can't be there or like do the things that i need to do like even for myself for my daughter like it'll just be trying to wiggle and do appointments which we all know doctor's office is mainly not open on the weekends, but it just be trying to, we're going to do everything on my days off, which if it's Monday to Friday, 9 to 5, 30, I would have to either get off work early or try to do it on a day. I have to schedule a day off to try to do my errands. I'm like, I don't know, but the guy's going to work everything out and then it's going to just fall how everything's supposed to fall. But I only got one bar on this battery and I hope I brought my other battery. Um, I'm looking to give me like a whole little camera bag, but not like a real camera bag. I'm going to have to get something else to like turn it into a camera bag because I don't want to have to keep taking my tripod on it all. But anywho, I'm rambling in a little bit. So yeah, I'll check in with y'all later. Alright, so I'm making a lot of progress today. I made it to my daughter's school, dropped her splint off made her orthopedics appointment um now i'm about to go into dollar tree i forgot what i needed from dollar tree though um yeah i don't know i'm gonna have a productive morning and a productive day it's 10 49 um yeah it's 10 49 so i'm about to run into dollar tree I got to run to the hair supply store. And then I think I'm going to stop and get me a hot before my nail appointment at 1.30 because I'm mad I had to go back home. You know, I hate going back home, but that was an in and out thing because I just had to get her splint. And I took that to her, uh, made her an appointment, scheduled my appointment, getting my schedule together for next week. And next week is a busy week also. Um, so yeah, I'm just checking everything off on my list. So yeah, we about to go into the Dollar Tree real quick. Anybody else, comment down below. Anybody else state like you got to bring in your own like shopping bags now. Like that burns me out because sometimes you be forgetting them. And it was like, you got to keep it in car. And I order all these Amazon stuff, y'all. <laughs> so it should all be here today, but I'm going to, uh, um, a 2000s birthday party so i took it back and got a little jersey dress it's gonna be cute when i put, once i put it all together but um yeah so i'll probably do another little unboxing later once all my packages come because they all supposed to come today um so yeah let's go all right y'all so real quick look ain't this so cute see i gotta stay at the dollar tree but look I'm going to put this in my um, middle console. But look, it's saying it's a pencil holder. Yeah, it's saying it's a pencil holder, but... No, it's about to be a, a car. Like, you know how you get your little... Look, prime example. <laughs> look, this little bit of toilet... Uh, not toilet tissue. From straws from when you go out to eat or whatever. It will go right in there and I just empty it out. I was like, OMG, that was so cute. Um, so everything else I got was like household stuff. Listen, my daughter's in the fifth grade, but I'm all about lear learning. The education starts at home, so I bought her some little flashcards because she's working on division and they just starting. And she said she's having a little trouble with it, even though they just starting. And I'm a pen girl, so I love some pens. 
Dollar Tree always has some good pins in there. So, um, so yeah, we about to head to the head. We about to head to the head head supply store. We about to head to the hair supply store, but my battery about to die. And I hope I put my other one. So I see you on a bit. See, this one gonna be like in a kill time. Now I done went in Target. Was only supposed to be getting money out of my ATM. So I did get the pants, but I got them in the medium. They should be okay because the small was like good. It was just easy and everything. I forgot a bag, so I literally walked out the store with everything in my hand. I got three of those sweaters um, that I showed y'all. And then this pink bodysuit. This is going to look so good in the summer. And then I needed some new body gel. So I like just everyday stuff. And I always like the bath and body works and be smelling all good, especially going to work. Mm -mm, I'm not wasting it. Don't work. So this smells so good. It's the St. Ives Oatmeal and Shea Butter. So now it's 1222. I'm about to go to IHOP and then um he had to get my nails done my nail appointment is at one or you i'm back battery dies so um what i say oh yeah i'm about to go to ihop uh my nail appointment and ihop is in the same parking lot so which is clutch so yeah i'm about to head there oh safety first let me show my seatbelt on so i'm about to head there and then eat me something because i haven't I didn't eat anything all day, so I'm about to head there to eat and then get my nose on and then I'm in the house. I didn't even, wasn't even supposed to go to Target to spend money, but I have a few trips coming up. So, yeah, it's better to be prepared than not prepared and yeah, I'll see y'all at IHOP. Alright y'all, so I'm finally home these are the nails can y'all see them a little ombre with a little design so these are the nails um yeah i was in there my appointment been was done but i was waiting to get my eyebrows done and i like to get my neck wet Is the whole hereditary thing, yeah. So, but I said, you know what? I'm gonna buy me my own little wax kit off of Amazon and start doing like my waxes myself. I don't know about my eyebrows because, well, my eyebrows are actually microbladed. They going on two years, probably even more than two years, probably like two and a half years since I got them done. Only did one touch up, and I think they're they still look good. Um, so, but I just like to get them cleaned up from i don't even get it cleaned up like often so i'm not even gonna say that probably every three months or something i just get like the excess here like just cleaned up and my hairline be sometimes trying to connect so i be in <laughs> it like a little shape up <laughs> but um yeah i did not plan on being out this long it's already almost five o'clock it's 4 57 my daughter is outside because it's actually nice today so i'm about to hear in the house and I still gotta wash and blow dry her hair for her hair appointment tomorrow. Um, so yeah, I don't know what time I'm gonna start that. I might start that at seven. Cause I need a little decom decompress a little bit before I do anything. So I'll probably start that at seven and then should be done around nine o'clock. And then she could go ahead and get in the bed. <laughs> But, um, yeah, overall, today was a productive day. I did get everything on my list done. Everything done that I needed to get finished. Um, so, yeah. And we're going to, I think, since I'm taking my daughter out this weekend, I think I'm going to end this vlog on Saturday. Yeah, I'm going to end it on Saturday. Only because, two, I didn't pick up the camera on Tuesday. So, it's kind of like I shorted y'all out today. So we're going to pick back up the camera on, well, I'm going to end the vlog on Saturday. Um, so yeah, so today's Thursday. We got Friday and Saturday. I'm going to end this Saturday because I'm taking my daughter out. And yeah, I'm excited for where we're going. 
she um she never been there before i never been there before so it'll be nice but i'm about to get in this house unwind a little bit before i gotta get into taming her here um so yeah i'll check back in with y'all later y'all i was such a terrible vlogger today I was on the go, on the go, on the go all day. It's currently 6.58. And I'm just getting in the house. Um, had to take my daughter to get her hair done. Her hair is finished. Now I'm about to go help my mom do her Facebook Live for her boutique that she has. She goes live every Friday and Saturday. Which I think is awesome and great. You know, a lot of us always be talking about... Oh, well, we need a website. We need to do this day and the third. I'm telling you, my mom goes live every Friday and Saturday. Hey, thank. Every Friday and Saturday and does very, very well um, on Facebook Live. Um, so, y'all, just start that business. You want to do a boutique, think you need a website, all that fancy stuff. Just start and then everything else will fall into play. You know, when it's time for it to fall into play. I'm telling you, every Friday and Saturday for the past two months, we've been going on Facebook Live. And I'm like the little administrator. I be in the back <laughs> taking the stuff, putting it to the side. We pick the orders on. If they order tonight, we try to ship them Saturday. If not Saturday, then they go on Monday just because church is on Sunday. And my mom and dad are pastors. So, therefore, things are on hold till after church and after they do service on Sundays. So, yeah, so she goes live at 7.30. So, I got a couple minutes and I'm about to unload and unwind for a second before I go down here and help her. So, I'll check back in with y'all later on tonight or I might put like a little clip in there or like how I help her out. And then tomorrow, I'm going to vlog and end the vlog off on Saturday just because I'm taking my daughter out. And this is going to be cute and fun. Neither one of us have been to the place that we're going. I actually filmed it on TikTok. Um, so, that'll be nice and fun. And then, yeah, we got church on Sunday. So, yeah, I'm going to close the vlog out tomorrow. And, yeah, I'll check in with y'all later on tonight. All right, y'all. So, it's currently 11.50. We just got done packaging up all the orders. It was a good night. But... I know I'm not supposed to eat after 8, but y'all, I'm starving. I done worked myself up an appetite being oh, down here with my mom. So, <laughs> so, um, yeah, we done. Got one more big order to pack, but yeah. It was a great night, but I'm about to eat and go to bed. So, I'll check in with y'all tomorrow. Good night. All right, y'all, so... I made it to our destination, but we about to go to the place that we going to. She don't know where we going. And it's going to be a great day. But I'm mad at you, yeah You 
always say I got an attitude, oh yeah. But that's you, you was acting when I had to ask you if you had a few Cause you always say I got an attitude, oh You better on the first date I should've said what's wrong in the first place I don't cause you always taking it the wrong way You won't listen, you're too busy playing 2K I've always been down but you still sleep and even though I said it now you should've been peed I feel it in my soul, yeah it's so deep So deep, you should know that about me I just turned, just turned down your avenue I had to but I'm mad at you Always say I got an attitude